I installed the weapon skin for the SMG Mark II, and now the image doesn't match what the gun looks like, so today I'll be showing you how to make images for the items in your server in your inventory. I'll leave links in the description for the background mover used, and a site I like to use called Pixlr. Alright, so first you need to find the image you want. I'm just here on Google Images, so we'll go with this one, and once we're here we're going to copy the image. And then we're going to go to the background remover site. All right, once we remove, we're just going to paste the image. And once it removes the background, we're going to hit the blue download and it should pop up like this. After that, we're going to go on to Pixlr and we're going to do create new. Once this comes up, we're going to do 100 by 100. And then we're going to hit create. From here, we're going to go to layer, add images layer, and then we're going to pick the background remove image you just downloaded, hit open, and then we're going to resize the image. All right, after you've resized it and it looks how you want it to, we're going to go file and we're going to save. We're going to save it as a PNG. And then I'm just going to do mp5k. And then we're going to save that. Alright, after you save that, we're going to go to the downloads and we're going to copy it from there. Next, we're going to go to QB inventory or whatever inventory script you use. And we're going to go to HTML and then images. When we're in here, we're just going to paste the image. And it's very important that you remember what you saved it as. After you put the image in the inventory folder, we're going to go to QB core shared and then items and we're going to look for the item that the image represents so i'm going to look for the smg mark ii here it is here and we're just going to keep scrolling over until we see the image so this is now going to be mp5k.png and here's where you can also rename the stuff uh, of course, where it says label, not the name. And then we're going to hit file and we're going to save. That is all you need to do. From there, you can start your server and test it out. All right, we're now on the server. And as you can see, the MP5 no longer looks like the default SMG Mark II. Thank you for watching. I hope this helped you out. If you have any questions or need help, feel free to comment down below.